Hey guys, it's Syndicate here, and finally, Rockstar have released some new screenshots of transportation in the new Grand Theft Auto V. Now, if you're wondering, Syndicate, why are you covering Grand Theft Auto V? Now, the reason is because I went to Gamescom recently in Germany, and when I went out there, I was really hoping there was going to be a Rockstar move, you know, showing off Grand Theft Auto V so I can get some hands-on, maybe a new trailer, maybe some, uh, you know, a short gameplay or some cinematics from the game that we haven't seen before. You know, something really cool that I can share with you guys, but unfortunately, there wasn't. But as soon as I've got back two days after, they finally released these images. So we've got the picture of the bike, which is something I'm really looking forward to because in San Andreas, you know, you could bunny hop and then when you got the bunny hop cheat on, you could like literally jump over buildings. It was really cool and just like wheelie around like a boss. So it's good to see that they're bringing bikes and the fun aspect of the game back, you know, instead of it just being like uh, the most uh, GTA 4 seemed like just like cut concentrating on like more realistic to me uh, but now to see like fun vehicles being back and now jet planes as well as you can see now the hydra just i'm gonna say it's the hydra because that's what it was in san andreas i'm really looking forward to seeing if this is back and if it is the hydra you know it's got rockets on the side of it hopefully it's got mini guns hopefully it can hover and everything like that you know just to really have some fun with you and your friends because um grand theft auto to me now is all about the multiplayer experience and i think that um rockstar you know have learned this through the games like max Payne and stuff like that um, that it's all about the multiplayer experience kind of from now on even though we all love solo imagine be able to like do the actual campaign and stuff with friends as well so it'd be cool to see if you can get in high just fly around together and stuff like that and even if it's you know just multiplayer in general you can just have some fun together but also on this note i want to drop in about parachutes i hope they're like available from unlock early on you know because um, from gta 4 we had the ballad of gay tony that you had to unlock parachutes from to be able to then have fun and jump around with them but hopefully with this new one, it's going to be, you know, something that you unlock like you did in San Andreas. You can go and find it. Or, you know, you did a cheat to get it. That sort of thing. Instead of having to buy a DLC to just get, like, a parachute. And, yeah, you know, you did get more guns with it, which is really cool. And I do hope they bring DLC out. I want to ask what you guys think about DLC for, like, games like Rockstar. Um, you know, it is cool to have, like, expansion packs and stuff like that. But when we wait for a game like this for so long, it is kind of annoying for them to be like, aha, we've got some stuff we've held back from you that we've been working on all this time. Um, and then we expect you to buy it, but I, I personally will buy it if they bring out DLC for it, but, you know, it would be nice to, for them to go, we're throwing it all out here, this is the game you've been waiting for, and enjoy it, you know, there's nothing else we're going to make you go and pay for, um, it's all going to be free sort of thing if we're going to release it, that'd be really cool for them to do that, but I don't think they will, you know, all companies want to make as much money as they can, don't they? So in this new image now, you can see the cheetah, finally, it's, you know, it's still here, it's one of the, like, the original cars from the Grand Theft Auto series, you know, it's an awesome car, it was super fast, super cool to get your hands on it, and it's just an awesome round looking car, and um, I'm looking forward to getting my hands on it, it's cool that they're keeping, you know, the, the traditional traditional route of Grand Theft Auto there, as, as always, and um, yeah, hopefully this game is going to be a lot of fun and a lot of adventuring, uh, what are you guys looking forward to with this game, if you want to leave a comment below, and if you are excited for the game, be sure to give the video a like guys, thank you for watching, my name's been Syndicate, if you want to subscribe to see any more information that I find of Grand Theft Auto oh, that I will be covering, because I actually really, really enjoy this game, then by all means do so guys. Thank you as always and adios.